today. Welcome to the On Lunch with Bilsif show, eh? Freaking right, boys and girls. Peoples, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and make sure you like it. Why wouldn't you? For the On Lunch with Bilsif. So today on lunch, we're gonna have to take a little route on a different location we are. We gotta get ourselves some natural medication we do. If you suffer from, you know, sleeping, stress, anxiety, freak boys, cancer, unfortunately, chronic pain, anything like that, just get yourself some CBD oil, boys, and she'll fix you right up. Freaking right it will. Natural herb, they say. So, as I told you before, I'm on an anxiety pill, boys. So I've been getting myself some little gummy bears, and ever since then, no pills for Bilsif. Strictly natural, boys. So if anybody says, oh, you didn't do that, there's no THC in what I'm getting. She's just... DDB, boys. So I would suggest, if you're not a big fan of the pills like I am, try some of that stuff and you'll be off your pills in no time, you will. Freaking right, you will. Makes me feel good, too. I feel better, my muscles don't hurt as bad. I feel about a couple weeks younger, boys. Just a couple. So I gotta light this cigarette up. We're gonna shoot down here and see what's really going on we are. Hopefully you don't think of me any differently for trying something a little different, boys. But I had to do something because those pills, I'm just not into them. Not into them. So, and it's working. I'm telling you right now, it's freaking working. It's only 10 grams. Get yourself some of that if you wanna fix yourself right up, boys. You can totally function. No high whatsoever. Totally function. Just relaxes your bones, boys. So we're gonna take a sink down here, around here, and up here, and up here, and on down here, and around here, but I'm not gonna tell you where, because I don't know what's really going on. So we're just gonna go up here and pick up my prescription that I ordered to the government. Good old doctor there gave me a prescription, he did. Why wouldn't he? He said, I know you don't like your bills, Belsif. So try this stuff. There you go. But anyways, besides that, I have no clue what the hell I'm gonna even eat today. To tell you the truth, I brought a frozen dinner, but by the time I'm done my run around at lunchtime, I won't have time for frozen dinners. Frick, because I have to go to Park Lane after I do and look at a leaky sunroof. Frick sakes. The sun's out today, it's drying up, it's not as cold, it's 52 degrees. 50, sorry, 52 Fahrenheit, boys. Something degrees, whatever the hell it works out to, because I have no idea. But that's what she is, so it's nice out today. How you doing? What the hell are they doing? Staying out in the middle of the field with papers, they are. Must be doing some surveying, eh? Hopefully everybody's having a good week. Today's Wednesday. Might be Thursday by the time you see us. Depends on what kind of night I have tonight. But tomorrow's Friday. It's really Thursday, but Friday's a holiday, boys. So tomorrow's Friday for me. Hopefully a lot of you other, too. Everybody in Canada it should be a holiday for you tomorrow. I don't know if the American... Is American Easter the same time? If it is, Friday's a holiday, boys. Okay? Take her off. Tell them Bill, Dirty Old Bill said, told you you could. Why wouldn't you? If your boss says no, Tell them those not in the schedule. Unless you're making double bubble, then hey, I'd work too. Oh, let's go for frick's sakes. Got a cluster fuck up here we do. Look at this, boys. Let me get the old camera going here. Where are you going, bud? Look at the cluster going on up here. Frick sakes. What's really going on? How you doing? Oh, I forgot to format that camera, so I'm gonna have other footage in with my other footage. Because I don't know if anybody uses a camcorder to do editing, but it comes out as a different file and you got to cluster convert it to this cluster fuck and do this and that and the other thing. It's just a pain in the ass, to be honest with you. And if you don't transfer it right, it just doesn't work. Dirty old GoPros, no problem. Oh, I got my batteries in for the dirty old GoPros yesterday too. Friggin' right I did. So now I got a little charge base and I got four extra batteries, boys. So we're going to have to try out that other GoPro because last night didn't have time. No time last night. Why would I have time last night? Plus it was raining anyway, so what the hell is the point of even freaking bothering? That's what I say. Come on there, Mr. Canadian Tire Shuttle. So technically, if tomorrow's Friday, that means today's Thursday, but it's really Wednesday, but on Thursdays I normally have lunch out. So I might just buy myself a lunch today because technically it's one day before the last day. You understand what I'm saying? I'm freaking right, you better, because I understand. Holy. Just ask Ricky. Ricky understands too. Speaking of Ricky and the old trailer park bubbles there, boys. Anybody watch the cartoons yet? They're not too bad, actually. Kind of get a kick out of the cartoons, I do. Because a good old Leahy pops his head in once in a while, poor old bugger. Freaking right. So I've been watching that. That's what I go to sleep with, a little bit of trailer park, boys. But anyways, I'm just about up here to my location, and uh, I'll be back. Oh, that was quick. Freaking right it was. Didn't take no time at all, eh? So now, we got to figure out what we're doing for lunch we do. 
bunch of boys. Girls, peoples. No idea, but we'll figure it out, we will. That lens just looks dirty, dirty. You're a dirty little lens, you are. Why are you so dirty? Why are you so dirty? Oh yeah, UDR, that's why you're so freaking dirty. Nothing like a dirty voice. So we're gonna take a ride down here we are, and around here, and over to there, and around here, and I might just get myself a couple of McDoubles, because I already got a pop in here. Maybe we'll just have a couple of McDoubles, and call her a day. Hey. Because I'm not that hungry anyways, to be honest with you. Oh, they got the crane set up to lift up this tower, boys. What's really going on? My camera's all cocked over. This freaking camera just pisses me off big time. I'm a doctor, not a fool, man. Doodly, it says. Uh, hurry up and wait. Why wouldn't we? Oh, I'm all freaking cocked over. Oh, everybody. Oh, yeah, you are. Oh, boys. Look at the size of the crane they got in there today. Oh, she's a big one. Look at that thing, boys. She's a big one. Decent. Holy. Freaking right it is. That's a big ass crane in there, boys and girls. She's got one hell of a thick cock on her, she does. She's no skinny beam on that one. Designed for lifting, boys. Nothing like a good design for lifting, boys. Ah, hey. Careful. Easy. Gentle. Everywhere you go, there's traffic. There is. Watch McDonald's. It's going to be lined right up. Don Al's, boys. Holy, this camera's just jerking everywhere. And it's not getting off either. Frig no. What is really going on around here? Phil Rado has some good torque when she tilts the camera down, eh? Little church roof action, little steel, steel action, boys. So we're gonna do the McDonald's thing. Obviously, we're here. So why wouldn't we? Jamie, I'm gonna hammer back this burger and think about you the whole time, bud. Hey, eh? because I know you're on lunch too right now. I don't know where you are, but hey, have a good lunch, bud. Why wouldn't you? This has always been my favorite McDonald's it has, eh? Downtown on Christina Street, boys. It tastes better than everywhere else. I don't know why. It's probably because they got rats in the kitchen here. Maybe that's what it is. There's no rats in the other location. I'm gonna have myself a rat burger. Why wouldn't I? Thanks, McDonald's. Why wouldn't you? How you doing? <laughs> yeah, I'm going crazy. It's okay. But he's got himself a burger. Look at it. Hey, okay. freaking right he does. Just so you know, boys and girls, peoples, I've lost friggin' 10 pounds, I have. So that's it, just keep calling me a fat bastard and you'll see one day, I'll be skinnier than you, I will. Especially when I'm on these friggin' McDonald burgers, like hardcore. That's gonna really make me lose weight. Might have to get three McDoubles just in case. Could change my mind. Oh, there you go, boys. Mac Picks meals, five bucks. That's what I should be getting. McPick. No, asking for money, they are. I'm gonna have uh, three McDoubles McDonald's. What's McHappy Day? McHappy Day is a day that we help raise money for sick children. Okay. They got me on the buck, boys. Anything to help sick kids for sure, eh? Make sure you help them sick kids out. Don't be cheap. It's only a buck. It's the buck, boys. How you doing? Oh, you're just beaming, you are. Holy, look at the head on that thing. What's really going on? McHappy Day is the day we raise money for Ronald McDonald House and local charity. Oh, okay, she told me wrong. I don't want to give you a buck now. No, just joking. There you go, that's perfect. And this year it's Pathways. Decent. Hello, were you talking to me back there on the speaker? No. Oh, <laughs> I was going to tell you, you're lying to me, you were. Out we go. Ah, shit. Come on. Excuse me. Boys, this is going to be like a freaking, like a seven minute drive around video with Bilson. Hey, hopefully they can get a 10 minute out of you. That way you can just screw you right over with all the ads I can. I could add more ads. Hey, what do you think of that? Make sure you watch them ads. Make sure you click on them ads. It gives me more money, it does. Hey, maybe. I don't know how it works. Look at that, boys. McDouble. How you freaking doing, eh? How you doing? I'll tell you how you're doing. You're having, do your eating my mouth, you are. Nothing like a good McDouble, boys. Makes you happier, it does. McDouble's always makes you happier. Until three o'clock. Then you go. Uh, I'm gonna pay for this. Holy, get the brakes on that thing, bud! It's like a brand new truck, for Christ's sakes. I'm not gonna tell you what kind it was, though. Guess. You think you know what kind of truck that was making all that noise? Comment below. Why wouldn't you? If you think summer's taking too long to come, comment below. Why wouldn't you? If you like to drive around at lunchtime with Nelson, comment below. Why wouldn't you? If you, how you doing? How you doing? Why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you? Let's go this way, boys. What's really going on, bud? Since when is this a UE zone? Why does the whole traffic up and do a UE wherever the hell I feel like it? Why wouldn't you? Sugar pop today, boys. Hey, a little Coke action. <coughs> oh, pardon me. I'm not a big fan of the Coke, boys. It makes you burp. Every time I drink Coke, I burp. Just so you know, if anybody sees me having to toss a butt, it's totally not my fault. 
I get talking, don't even get thinking, and I toss her, boys. I got a cup right down here, but if I'm talking away, sometimes just old habits die hard. I try not to litter with butts. I apologize if you see one go out the window. It's really, honestly, not done purposely. It's because I'm talking to you, and I lose focus on that part of it. If you happen to ever see a butt go out the window, I really apologize. Just leave a comment below. Hey, Bill, you threw a butt out the window. Smart up, and I will, boys. I promise. But every once in a blue moon, yeah, old habits die hard, boys. My theory is if you throw a butt out the window like that, that's great insulation for a birdie's nest, it is. The birdies come pick it up and they stuff their nest full of them, right? That way when the wind's strong, it's like freaking insulation, boys. It's like insulation, boys, eh? Pretty right it is. Just keep that in mind. Bear with me. I don't mean to litter, boys. That's all I want to say about that. Oh, there's a step on dealer. Quick, hide, boys. That guy gets me every time he does. Have a little Perry time in the park, boys. I'm kind of looking forward to going to the old park lane this afternoon and have a look at a sunroof. Maybe I can uh, make an afternoon out of her. How you doing? Why wouldn't you, Mr. CN? Freak, boys, I don't want to go back to work. Whenever I get out talking to you guys, I don't want to go back to work. Drive around all day with you guys and hang out and have a good old time, I do. Oh, I do want to mention one thing. Kevin's got the old backflip challenge going on with the RC cars, so I got to make a trip to London this weekend to get my parts for sure, I do. Dennis, if you're watching this, I'll be seeing you this weekend. Friggin' right I will. Because I'm going to use the old Slasherewski because that thing just seriously backflips, it does. How you doing? How the hell are you doing? Why the hell wouldn't you be doing good? But anyways, that thing is serious backflip material, and I want to win that challenge, I do. I can't remember. Kevin, comment below. I'm not sure. I didn't read or didn't see how many flips he actually made. Comment below and let me know how many flips you got out of her. Or I'll just watch the video game and count myself. Maybe why wouldn't I? But anyways, boys, I'm almost back to work here, so hopefully everybody has a good rest of their day like I'm going to have, because I'm going to make sure I do, because life's too short not to have a good day. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Make sure you subscribe, like, comment below if you want to tell me anything, and uh, you know what to do for now.